little YouTube. And that's what we're gonna ride right behind us. Let's you go just, do this, guys. Let's go do this real quick. We got our tickets to skip the line. We gotta go through security and all that stuff. And we're gonna ride a big high roller Paris wheel. 550 feet tall. It's one of the tallest wheel rides um, in the world, yes. actually. Uh, let's if, go do this. Let's go do this right now. Let's get in line, or we'll be jumping the line. But let's get this going real quick. Get out of the big wheel. Uh, we pass security easily. And uh, if we want anything to drink while we're riding the wheel, we get it right here. But I think we're not going to get anything to drink. So we're going to board right here with our tickets. Right there. And hopefully we'll see some nighttime views of Las Vegas, Nevada, right? Yes. All right, let's go ahead and let's do this. Board. This is the boarding station, guys. This is pretty nice. Nice, awesome. We're going to get in a, a pod after they get done with the light show. And we'll be boarding this pod right here. In the bubble. And the bubble will rotate as we are uh, working our way up to see the views of Las Vegas, Nevada. I'll get the strip side. I'll get the uh, the south side. Uh, actually, the east side will face the west. There goes a monorail back there. Uh, we'll see what kind of night views we get. Energy Line is two of ten people in this pod. This pod can hold at least maybe uh, 20 safely, I think. So right now we're working our way up to 550 foot high. Then we'll work our way down. Right now we're looking at uh, the Venetian in that direction. And uh, we'll see what the rest of Vegas looks like. This, this is that new uh, MSG uh, spear. They're still working on the outside of that. And we're going to start seeing the lights of Las Vegas in the distance in that direction as we work our way up. Uh, we'll see some other tall buildings. We'll probably uh, see the airport as we get higher. Right now, we're not quite tall enough for most roller coaster slip hills at this point. I just let you know buying the, buying the tickets ahead of time online. Uh, we saved ourselves at least 30 minutes at the uh, ticket window. So if you can, if you do ride the high roller here in Las Vegas, uh, I advise to get those tickets uh, in advance. Uh, book your tickets the day you want to ride it, anytime tickets. And you can ride it anytime uh, during the day. Uh, just read up on it. Uh, we choose to ride it at night because this is when we get the best views on this thing at night. Uh, later in the week, we will do the strat, but we're going to do the strat during the day. As we're looking at the Harris Casino right there, there's the Lynx right there, and there's the Flamingo. I'll have a, a video involving down there behind the Flamingo because there's a Flamingo Park uh, with real live flamingos in there. Direction of the airport, which is I think in that direction, and as of right now, we're at the height of most roller coasters with lift hills. As of right now, and it looks like we're gonna go even higher. Uh, remember the tallest roller coaster in the United States, uh, King of Car? Uh, that's at 400 and uh, no, that's almost over 500 feet right there. Uh, yeah, it's actually 450 feet. I think it's 450 feet. Yeah, I'll have to look it up. It's, yeah, it's 450 feet. Uh, because the top of the tractor, which is no more at Cedar Point, is uh, 420. And we're going to be at 550 on this first wheel ride. Okay, as we're looking in this direction, you're looking at the distance at Westgate. Uh, Westgate was the before it was Westgate, it was the uh, Hilton, and that's where uh, I'm taking a video of it right now. I'm taking a video of it right now. Okay, uh, Angie had a text message from her mom uh, right there, with below my finger. Let me zoom it. In. Uh, let me zoom it away. 
uh, basically. Right there, where my fingertip is right there, that's Westgate. That used to be the Hilton. And that's where Elvis Presley was last, uh, he was a resident performer there before he passed away back in the 70s. And that. And I'm hoping we'll get a closer video of it uh, in one of our must do videos here in Vegas. Okay, I had a block of reflection here. But we're looking towards the Rio, Caesar's Palace, and uh, there's the uh, Palms Casino in the distance. Palms was closed last year, but this year they're open, and we had a chance to eat the lobster buffet, but we decided to eat at Caesar's Palace instead. But there's the distance, there's the lights of Las Vegas, this is the direction we came in from, from that direction uh, when we came to town, but when we leave, We'll be exiting in that direction on Sunday, uh, or whatever you watch this edited video. Uh, time you watch this video, we ought to be home, uh, basically. Oh yeah, and we're looking uh, towards the north and towards the uh, up there by the wind, uh, the fountain blue, and behind the fountain blue, that red thing that's sticking up is the stratosphere tower. And behind that is Fremont uh, Street and downtown casinos. Uh, we're looking at the Cosmopolitan, looking towards uh, the Lexor. We'll get it on the other side here real quick, so it's uh, not so much reflecting. Down there is the Bellagio. The pounds are not running right now. Hopefully we'll catch the pounds during this uh, Ferris wheel ride. See that dome right there? That dome is about ready to go over the top, and we are going to be right there with it in a few seconds. But we are looking towards the distance of the city of Las Vegas. Looks awesome out there, guys. This is why I like to ride it at night. You can see the lights for miles and miles. Oh, perfect. Okay. Okay, as of right now, we're about ready to go over the apex, the highest part. Yeah. You are seconds away from hitting the peak. Oh, perfect. I felt that one. Perfect, perfect. Cool, mess. All right. Four, three, Absolutely. Love you, man. See ya. One. This is now over. We're up and over. We're at the highest point. Now we're working our way down already. Congratulations. Now we're looking uh, south on the strip. You can see possibly the Lexor uh, light. You can see Mandalay Bay. There's the Grand Hill Institutions. There's the uh, Paris MGM uh, Grand. And all those other good casinos out that way. New York, New York Casino also. But right now we are working our way back down. All right, past the halfway bar. Working our way down. Cosmopolitan to the left over there. But yeah, this is always a fun ride. If you do come, uh, always get these tickets at, in advance. Remember, there's a security check. Make sure that you check. Make sure they see all your cameras, cell phones, keys, uh, fanny packs, uh, purses, whatever uh, that may be in, uh, that may be uh, considered dangerous. There's already those people that was wow. right there has already reached its apex. The one right behind it is reaching its its apex. That means the top of the wheel. As we are looking towards uh, the, the Venetian, Treasure Island, the Mirage, uh, Caesar's Palace, which we are going to have a wonderful buffet. That clip of that video will be coming up in our eat in our Vegas Eats video, what we ate in Vegas videos. Like I said, you can see this Ferris wheel for miles because that's about where we came in in that direction where I'm aiming the camera. Uh, we came in about in that direction someplace. And that. So it was a fun trip coming in, but hard to believe. Uh, time to watch this video. We're already home. Uh, but then, we are, like I said, when we do the edited videos, we are seven days behind and we still have to work our home videos on our way home. We still got the Roosties. Um, we'll probably do a shopping video uh, on Thursday 
that's tomorrow. Uh, we'll probably do a um, we'll probably do something else with uh, Fremont Street on Friday. Saturday will be Hoover Dam, and Sunday will be uh, on our way home. And if any other extra videos that we make, uh, they'll be added on uh, before our way home trips. We have a special video on the promenade right down below us. Uh, it's a very unique situation. It's many of the what they call pockets uh, that Vegas uh, that people don't know about here in Vegas. Uh, it's a little pockets uh, in there. Yes, you do see a swimming pool over here. Yes, there's a swimming pool behind the flamingo. That's the swimming pool behind the links. Those pools are closed for the season already. I'll have some about the flamingo park uh, down in there. Uh, hopefully uh, soon, as I will say, one of those must-do uh, things. And I think uh, the promenade would be a must-do. Uh, the Eiffel Tower at the Paris Casino. And there's, in the distance, right there, see the Bellagio Fountains just going off right now. This is the second time we caught the Bellagio Fountains on our Paris World ride, and it's usually it's coming on our way down. There goes the mountains at the Bellagio. We are working our way down to down there. We'll be ready to wrap up this video. I hope you guys enjoy the highlights of this uh, high roller wheel. I can't believe you guys did we two were, years in a row. Two years in a row we did this. It's hard to believe we were way, way up there. Now we're working our way down there, which is not too far to go. So I hope you guys enjoyed this video, and we're going to wrap it up there on the promenade. As we're about to get off, we'll be exiting in that direction, but there's certain bubbles on this wheel is dedicated to happy hour. Uh, it's an upcharge to about $60, and it's all you can drink for 30 minutes. And you see, we did not uh, take advantage of that, because the bar would have been sitting right in the, in the dark. But it would have been a happy hour, it would be $60 for 30 minutes of unlimited drinks. And we did not do it. We just took the basic ride. And this basic ride is over. Right now, we'll finish this video in a couple of seconds here. For the next clip. We're just enjoying a walk down this ramp. Hope you guys enjoyed that big wheel that's behind us. Uh, we're hoping next time we'll do it during the day. But yeah. two years in a row at night, it's awesome. It's you can see uh, the lights miles away, but if you ride it during the day, uh, usually they sell out during the day because that's when you see the, the mountains uh, in the area. That's why they call Vegas the Valley area. Right now, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. We'll have more uh, content. We'll do it here in Las Vegas uh, tomorrow, all right? I think it's a shopping video tomorrow, it I believe. Is. All right, let's close this out. All right, please like, share, subscribe. Do not forget to hit that subscribe button, notification bell, and we'll see you later. Bye. Bye.